Hello, it is September 2nd. Uh, I've been meaning to do these for a while now, but I've always wanted to do like a vlog of my time here in Korea. Uh, I have the computer to edit, I got all that stuff now. So, today I'm going to be going down to this little coffee shop. It's a new shop called Wad Coffee, but it's by my bus stop. I pass it every day to work, so I want to go check it out, see if it's any good. Uh, I'll see you guys down there. one thing here in Korea there's lots of uh, different coffee shops and they're all very very good I don't think they use any sugar but it's pretty sweet all the time got to wait for those cicadas they're loud out here a few moments later so I moved to Korea uh, I moved here last April of 2022 uh, there's a number of different reasons why I made this move. Uh, first being was it was a time of like that housing bubble in the United States. Uh, I was looking to move out of my parents' house and rent was anywhere from 1500 to 2000 for some small little tiny studio apartment and I just I just thought that was ridiculous. So that was probably the first reason why I came out here. I had to switch spots again. There's this little family that came with like three or four dogs and they were just kind of barking a little bit. Um, but I found this cool little pergola. I'm not really sure what these are called. I should probably know. But uh, I think it was on my second reason why I moved here to Korea. Um, I found a job offer, I think it was on Craigslist, for teaching English as a foreign language here in Korea. Uh, I'd mentioned the housing bubble in the States where rent was just way too high and this job offered uh, to pay for my rent, my housing. Uh, I saw the pay for utilities, but another thing here in Korea is that you, once you get your ARC or alien registration card, you get put onto their insurance plan, which means you're paying nothing for any kind of insurance or health that you need, uh, health coverage. Uh, anything that's like dental related, you still need to pay a premium for. You could get onto a separate insurance plan for that, but I just decided not to. Um, there's those cicadas again, man. They're so loud. 12 seconds later. The third reason why I moved here to Korea was I have like a really big itch to travel all the time. And I would admit I spend way too much money traveling. Um, but I saw this as an opportunity to live here in Korea, experience all the cultures that they have here. Uh, every day is just another new adventure for me because it's a country I didn't grow up in. And then just being in Korea, now it opens the door to travel to all these countries uh, here on this side of the world. Uh, I've been to Thailand already two times, and I think I'm going to Japan this fall. Uh, I'm still looking into that. It's going to be for the Chuseok holiday, uh, which is really expensive, but I think that's something I want to do. So right now I'm living in Yonsugu, Incheon. Uh, it's a small little town, but it's a very tight community. There's lots of English teachers that live here too. And we have this one bar that we kind of all go to on the weekends uh, just to hang out and socialize. But I think I'm going to show you guys my neighborhood a little bit and then I'm going to head home and get some dinner. So let's go.
So, this is the street that I live on. Uh, lots of little coffee shops, restaurants. This big building right here is where I live. I live on the 10th floor there, and I can show you guys a little tour of that soon. So guys, I am back at my apartment, and I think this could be the end of the video. I'll give you guys a little apartment tour and another one. Uh, till then, hope you enjoyed. I know I have a lot to improve on, but you gotta take a step to learn, you know? So, I'll see you guys in the next one.